it's a different kind of <laughs> hanging out with movie John Rousey got her hair darkened. Looks pretty good. And the sun's shining pretty <laughs> bright, but I don't know if I can get you real good. It's hard to see with these sunglasses. But uh, yeah, we're in a cemetery checking out some stuff today. This is a building here. Now, about nine years ago, I filmed a video for Cyber Ray 1976. Uh, he sat over here on these steps and was doing an update. We called it the Halloween special. He was showing off horror DVDs and stuff new to his collection. And uh, we never did try to get in here. I think it's like a mausoleum or something. So, But, uh, yeah, the beginning of that video, I panned down from the top down to right here. And uh, he sat right here and showed off his DVDs. It's got a sign on the door. What's this? Oh, they locked the doors. Oh, a certain day. It's unlocked now. Looks like they uh, do services in here and stuff. And there's the... Uh, names over here on the walls I don't want to be put in a wall or oh, or buried or buried and there's a little they don't even have the lights on in there that's kind of creepy what? one that's behind the curtain why'd you stop like that for really I don't know what's back there man <laughs> what's back there Oh, these are like uh, little urn things and stuff, ain't it? Rousey just scared the shit out of me over here. Pulling that. Yeah, you just Like I was saying, these are like uh, urns and stuff that they put in here. I didn't know they put these kind of stuff in here. But, uh, yeah, everything's echoing in here. I wonder why they don't have the lights on in here. Oh, there they go. Yeah, these are really cool. God, they've been here for a while because that says 63 and 76. The little ledge where they can put the uh, flowers and stuff on. Hmm. All you horror fans out there, you know mausoleums and the movie you think of is Phantasm. So I'm waiting for the tall man to run out and chase us down through here or the spear come flying out and try to chase you down. Here's another door over here. Where's this guy? Well, it's not real. Doorway. 1878. In 1960, so this. This still looks pretty good to be that old. What's in here? Oh, there's just a few of them in here too. That goes all the way to the ceiling. With uh, I wonder how they get them open to put somebody in them though. That's weird. This side doesn't have them though. Stained glass. Some of these have little angels and stuff set. Now, this is cool with the little ledge that you can put flowers and stuff mm -hmm. in here. But this is a lot more expensive than being buried, too. Sure. Small. Yeah, then we're just like ashes and oh, stuff, yeah. I'd say. That one's even got a picture with it. You gotta get some air. It's kind of stuffy in there. It's a pretty big cemetery, though. You should get creeped out I in there. Did that whole thing, when I touched it, that was holding chairs mm -hmm. and the lever part came and the curtain came with it, it looked like something coming my heart started racing scared the hell out of her yeah. <laughs> and you never seen you never seen phantasm we might have uh -uh. to watch that soon okay. that's got a lot to do with the cemetery and uh mausoleum and stuff really? yeah look motley hey, there's a lot of graves down there i wonder what that other little building down there is i guess so these have not just tombstones, but they have little markers, too. Most of the other cemeteries around here that's, uh, well, no, I wouldn't say older than this place or uh, not as old as this place. They don't. They usually have markers. Most of the, the cemetery where uh, my family is buried at has markers. They don't have tombstones, which tombstones are a lot more expensive, I hear, too. So. Yeah, they are. Yeah, there's Martin. <laughs> Rhonda just pointed that out, her last name. You won't find my last name up here anywhere. If you did, you'd probably be better off winning the lottery than finding my name up here because you won't find Navy. Look at this one over here. This one's got like a ball on top of it or a spear or whatever. That's, that one's old. You can't there's even no read date. on it. There's no date. You can't it's even like read that. Like 
Cafe. Then they have these kinds over there. You see that one over there? That's on top okay. of the ground. Them things where they put them on top of the ground. Is that what that is? Yeah, they're on top. That's creepy. There's just a thing sitting on top. They don't bury them. They put them in the ground like Stop that. Stop it. They do. They just open the top up and... Get out of Why would you I mean, do there's, that? There's, there's, there's coffins in it, though. I mean... There's not. Why would you do that? <laughs> Why would you do... We're going over here to see this because Rhonda says... We... And you know what? I hear that that's more expensive than putting you in the ground, too. Some people just have too much money, even when in death, and they can uh, put them in these things, but... That you cemetery. Could just put me in the backyard. Put okay? you in the backyard. Yep. I'm getting cremated, so I ain't worried about it. There's a snowman on there. Yeah, there's a snowman. See, then this one's been there since at least the 70s, and then they had the uh, wow. look like the well, one died seven, one died 97. Yeah. But yeah, they're on top of the ground. They just take that off, and the coffins are in there. There's a few of them up here too. And then there's like little things like that over there. That's kind of like a small mausoleum right there. Did you notice that? There's one? another one over there. The two last names are not the name that's in the middle. It ain't the name. That's weird. Well, maybe that first one is. Maybe that's a middle name. I don't know. Then there's another one over here. That's like one by itself. That's, I think you can actually, I don't know. They probably can't get the doors open to it or nothing, but I've seen them before where you can go in them and stuff. Don't know. I doubt it. They got a, probably a lock on it. I really wouldn't open that up though. Oh, I'm gonna try. <laughs> but anyway, there is some like that. It's got doors on it, and I'm not for sure if the coffins are just sitting in there or what. They have to be probably. I gotta know now. They probably got probably something like that. It's a that concrete thing. Like that was built in 1939. Yeah, they're probably like a concrete thing, kind of like that in there with it in there. I'd say. But there's another one of them. Open the door. I'm, you're not opening the door. And last time you opened the door over there at the <laughs> other place or moved the curtain, you freaked yourself out in there. Hey, I have friends. I had just cut the video too at the time. Then I went back to see her do that stuff. I have friends that in the back of their yard is a cemetery and people, and it's like this, not like huge. There's maybe a hundred plots back there, uh -huh. but that's their backyard is a cemetery. Uh -huh. That would freak me, creep me out. And this place goes over the hill down through here too. This is a, pretty big and up through that way where we parked there you see the truck way down there there's a road that goes up behind there with a bunch of cemetery uh graves and stuff too it's quite a bit down through there too we uh hopefully we're not uh <laughs> boring anybody we seem to uh, like this stuff i like coming to <laughs> some of the old it's been a while since i've been out to this one though but i asked rousey this morning i said you want to go to a cemetery and film a hanging out movie john she said sure that would be cool like to see some old graves and stuff. Yeah. There's a bunch of them over there. Here's what. Do what? Oh, well, you can't help it sometimes. Cause see, some of them are like this right here, and then you got one in here. That's sideways going that way. It's weird. Why would you do that? I don't know. Save space. Don't understand that. This guy was young. Oh, uh, he was in the war. Oh uh, yeah. He was only 24. Hmm. Maybe he died in the war? 1951? Yeah, he was born yeah. in 26. Hmm. So that means this cemetery's been here a while. There was some in here I found before that was like died in like the early 1900s. So this place has been here quite a while. I wonder if there's anybody famous buried here. You never know about some of these places. I'd like to go to some famous uh, cemeteries. I watch uh, Hollywood... Uh, graveyards on uh, YouTube and they always show the uh, famous people on there and stuff going to a lot of places out in LA and stuff but just never know could have been somebody buried here oh, I wonder if baby. Gilligan's buried here baby. Gilligan uh, what was his name John Bob Denver yeah. Bob Denver was actually living in this area before he died I'm wondering if where he was buried at or if did they cremate him or what you never know could be buried up here that's really weird because that one's facing that way and that one's facing uh -huh. that way. It's probably just like ashes or something, maybe. Who knows? Maybe. And something like that. But uh, there's some more of them things. There's another one down there with the doors and stuff in it. Let's open it. No, you're going to open it up and something's going to follow you home. <laughs> Somebody says, uh, don't be messing with my stuff here, buddy. I'm going to follow you home. I've already had Penny follow me home. Yeah, we don't want to talk about Penny. <laughs> Maybe we'll have a show one time dedicated to you and Penny and I'm telling you. the other stuff that thought might have happened. 
Yeah, there's another one, and that one's really old. You can tell by looking at it. Pretty, and I don't know if that's even got handles on that one. I wonder where the caretaker's at. They got a caretaker here that spends a few hours each day. I know they got a grass, a grass crew. I was going to say a grounds crew. Look at this one. That one's got a bench inside of it. That's pretty. Yeah, this one's been here a long time. Now you got to be pretty either wealthy. wealthy or popular or something in this area to have something like this. And it's been here a long time and there's no <laughs> handles on that. But this is pretty daggone big. That's well over probably 15 feet tall. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Oh, it doesn't have, no. it's not glass. It's got those things inside and flowers and all kinds mm, of stuff. That's what it is. I want to see it. And you can't go inside, man. She's crazy. She's trying to get inside. She's going to piss somebody off. <laughs> I don't, I don't There's see another it. one over this way. There's another one right here. That's got, oh, that does have handles and stuff on it. You're just dying to know. I am. That's got glass and everything. Oh, yeah. There is a keyhole for a lock, though. I see. Good <laughs> Lord, I heard that on the camera, I hope. <laughs> Burp. Burping her up. And then it goes down the side of this hill where we came out at. Pretty big place. We was, I think me and Eddie, we was way back there one time. He did another little video where uh, Eddie's standing in front of a tombstone and he says something from Friday the 13th and then he points down at the uh, tombstone and it says Jason on it. Really? But it's got a sign, it's got a Jewish sign and, Jay, and he says on the video, he goes, I didn't know Jason was Jewish. And then we cut it. It was just a real quick video that he put on his channel, which he ain't done videos in like eight years. But uh, if you go back to that, look up Cyber Ray 1976. There's one called Jason. I didn't, or Jason is Jewish with a question mark, or it might say I didn't know Jason was Jewish, something like that. If he still has that video, I think that was from like 2000, probably 2010. It's probably been almost 10 years actually. So it's back then sometime. Then there's that road continues and goes all the way down there and comes is back up around that way. Where we parked. I don't know if that goes down through that way or not, or it might go all the way around to the backside and back up, but this is a pretty big place. Ain't much to do on Sunday sometimes, and this is something that you don't have to have no money to do. Just come hang out in the cemetery, walk around, get some exercise. You forget where we live, so. And uh, film a video, because I really didn't have much to do with hanging out with Movie John this week, so hanging out in the cemetery. <laughs> Dude, it's spooky down through here. No, does that road? No, that road goes back out to the main road. Oh. It doesn't curve back up that way. But we can go all the way around and come back up if you want to walk that far. Sure. Oh lordy, a lot of, a lot of graves down through here. Back in the days, I always heard. Did you ever hear of them? Uh, back before, like the late seventies, I hear. You know, they dig you down six foot deep to bury you now right. but back before like the 80s i heard in the 70s and beyond before that it was only three feet do you, you ever heard that uh -uh. i don't know that's what i've heard so tell movie john what you want to be done you want to be buried you want to be put in a wall and scare Rhonda like that back there <laughs> or you want to be uh cremated uh so many different kinds of ways uh people was cremated and put in them little things and they still could put you somewhere or you can spread your ashes somewhere or whatever. I know it's kind of dark kind of uh, content today, but we just decided to get out and do something different for a change. So that's how it is on Hanging Out with Movie John. We don't want to go to flea markets every single week and film the same stuff. We'll do flea markets and Walmart and cemeteries. <laughs> Somebody's been drinking. At the cemetery, man. And you wouldn't be surprised if you see a damn used condom somewhere. You know, some people like to come screw in the cars and there stuff like go. that. There okay. you go. Might find something like that left out. I think I found something like that one time at a cemetery. <laughs> this goes all the way back down to the main gate. And right here is the front gate across the street. Dollar General right there. They got a Dollar General everywhere anymore. And then these steps. I don't know why they have these steps. But 
at one time maybe they had something up there at the top of them but there ain't nothing but trees now and they're awful steep too and there's the front gates you come in here at this place that used to be like a little antique store or i don't know but yeah right across the way is the dollar general we could have just stopped there and got the allergy pills before we got here i forgot about that being here And here's a flower policy up here. That's been there a while. Getting tired of walking? No, it's good. No, you good. She's in shape, man. That's right. You remember earlier where I was talking about Saba Ray showing off the tombstone with Jason on it. This is it over here. I found it. It was not too far off the road. And has the Jewish sign in it. The star and everything. That was nine years ago. Rousey up here looking around. 